a tough spot again, Rach. What do you want to do? How do you want to handle it, huh? Do you want to fight for us or do you want to bail? Today, I'm bringing y'all a whole different style of vlog. Y'all don't have never seen this type of vlog ever in y'all life. So y'all welcome. Hopefully y'all like. Remember to like, subscribe. Welcome back guys, Team Dynite Vlogs. Back again with a fucking banger, y'all. One of my spots that I like to come just be by myself. Stay away from everybody. So I like, I just found this spot. Woman over here with my family. We've been so peaceful because it's by a field. Nobody comes here but me. And like vultures and shit. Fuck them. Fuck the Falcons. Fuck Joseph. I love Joseph. I feel safe around here, which is kind of trippy. Over there in Chicago, I can't be, I can't go to a park and just lay back, look up at the sky, have headphones on, and um, not be conscious of my surroundings. Like, I feel unsafe. I feel like anybody could just pull up, steal my shit, rob my ass, do some shit to me. But over here, it's different. Put my music on. I could blast C bands, especially that unreleased. That nigga going crazy. I'm not gonna lie. The only thing I don't recommend is there's so many spiders over here, but like, stay away. If you hear spiders, don't even go to college. I follow you everywhere. Just don't even go to college. It's not worth it. I'm about to show y'all a spider right now. Speak. I'm looking at that little fucker. He coming over here too, bitch. I don't know if y'all see that spider web right there, bro. I'm scared. I'm terrified right now. This is me right now. This is what it looks like. It's so nice at night. Matter of fact, we're actually gonna climb one more. Why not? If I'm here, I'm gonna show y'all the best stairs. I'm not gonna lie. Holy fuck, there's more spiders. I think I'm in the wrong facility. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, like real shit though. Have a conversation right now, real shit. Who in their right minds was like, bro, I'ma create spiders. I'ma create these little fucking fuckballs. I'ma make sure they have hella hair. And I'ma make sure they have like 8,000 legs. Like who in their right mind? Honestly, fuck spiders. Okay, but look, now that we're on the topic of self-reflection, I want to tell y'all something. His name is C. Benz. I know y'all know his ass. And if y'all don't know his ass, he's the nigga that I be rapping. <laughs> Just put it as simple as that. He's been my homie since second grade. Like, he'd always come over. I said, like, every day, bro. And we was like, fuck it, gang. We finna start a YouTube channel. And we actually shared a YouTube channel. Which it was like, we had so many YouTube channels. We had, like, Panda uh, Production. We had a little game named IBB. I think September 18, 2015, I started my YouTube channel named Team Dynite. Team Dynite came to be because of a YouTuber named Syndicate that I used to watch. Uh, I used to love it. And that's how Team Dynite was created. I was a fanboy of another YouTuber's Minecraft character. Y'all ain't know. Y'all know. I think I need a hit. Well, I feel like when I hit my pen, it, I be seeing it full. And then literally the next day, I be like, it's dying. Go watch the recording because I slow, low key forgot what I was saying. But look, y'all, make sure that when you guys have something you guys want to do when you guys are young, let's say you're in first, first grade, older, sixth grade, fifth grade, whatever. If you have a goal right now, you're able to start. Because for me, I wanted to be a YouTuber since a young. I was, I was fat, I was shy, I didn't express myself, I was scared. If you knew me when I was younger, you knew that I'm not the same person I was. I don't give a fuck anymore. <laughs> now I just, bro, I can literally go into Walmart and start screaming and I don't give a fuck. I was scared to be me. Just put it like that. I had this goal, but I kept putting it off. I, I used to have like this little uh, phone. that's like Samsung on five or the PS4. I used to set up my phone and record the screen. And I used to post those videos. That shit used to be fun to me. But then I never recorded like myself. I actually, I recorded one video of myself and it was, it was like, hey guys, look at that guys. Uh, guess what? We're going to go to the dentist. I posted that video and all my friends had me on YouTube. They had me on YouTube. So as soon as I fucking, as soon as I, I uploaded, they got the notification. So I go to school and these fuckers are like, welcome back guys. Team Dynai Vlogs back again with a brand new video. And I have a very special place that we're gonna go. I'm gonna let y'all guess. One, two, three, four, five, I did that. He's like, yep, the dentist. You know who you are, gang, Enrique. Ho ass, as that used to believe me. Not like that though. It was just, it's like making fun of it. But that shit, they don't know it, but that shit like, bro, that shit used to like get to me in a way. But like, it's one of the reasons, main reasons why I was like, I really just didn't want to record myself because that shit just like, I'm talking about like, that shit just tur tur turn me the fuck off. It made me shy, it made me feel embarrassed. It made me feel embarrassed. So I stopped and then I I hit the fucking sixth, seventh grade and started streaming shit. I'm streaming, that's when I started streaming. When high school came around, I still didn't pick it up, but I still had it on my mind. I was talking to C-Bans like, gang, 
Like, what are we finna do? This is a time where she band started rapping, for sure, for sure. He was rapping seventh to eighth grade, but he wasn't rapping like he is now. He started, his his rap career started going up. He started getting better. He started being more consistent. I forgot about my YouTube. I said, fuck my YouTube. I started trying to get with, with, with C band. So I got inspiration from his shit. So I was trying to help him. I want to say I helped him a lot because, I mean, I'm just a fucking, he's the one creating the music. But I was just trying to be there because... I know what that man has got fucking, he could rap. Like, I be hearing, like, I'm from, I'm from Chicago. When you go, when you walk around and shit, you 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 end up bumping up to, up to homies' homies, and they be rapping, they be starting freestyle, put a beat on, motherfuckers start freestyling shit. So I, I heard motherfuckers freestyle, motherfuckers came up to me like, oh yeah, how can my homie can freestyle? Let me hear that shit. Shit's ass, you feel me? But you can't judge, because they just started that shit. I knew once I heard C-Bands freestyle when he was younger, and he started getting better. I was like, bro, this dude got it. I have to support this dude got it. I have to support, not only because he's my fucking homie and I love that guy, but because like I know he has a talent and he don't see it yet in himself. So I'm going to be there, you feel me? A homie is supposed to support you, but support means that you need to tell them the truth. You need to tell your homies the truth, not just what they want to hear. Not because you're a homie, you got to hype them up. Yeah, it's cool to hype your homie up, but remember to tell them the truth when hype. You can hype them up, but remember, you got to be like, hey, yo shit fire, but like, you could you could work on this. And that's going to help them. And I, and if you a real homie, if you the creator, and you that you a real homie, you're not going to take it as no, as no, like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, I'm the one doing this shit. Nah, you should take it as like, oh, I appreciate you for letting me know what, I'm, what I could do better. And it's point of view look y'all i know this was a definitely a different type of video that y'all wasn't probably not expecting i was probably expecting a hyper little video i needed to, to know that the diehard team dianai fans i want them to know that who the fuck i am but if she think i want her for her i really want the jaws how the fuck we watching jaws but your bitch gave me jaws and she want me call her lift but i made that bitch jaws i remember class royale felipe used to spam the log and they used to call me janitor the way i bring the mob and i used to have these bitches crying when they took the cock and i think i why she turned into a bob And I'm up early yelling I guess you can call me cop No cereal or milk But I can get a nigga pop And I'm